It looks like enough to me. Yeah, it was just perfect Damascus. Perfect Damascus? I have never done that. Hey, how's it going, everybody? This is your pal Impossible I'm here. And uh, we're back at Fantasy Blacksmith. We got work to do. There's And we got all sorts of new stuff. We got a, a Coke's uh, smoking machine, which uh, makes, uh, you know, a, a better version of coal, essentially. And uh, what else did we get? We got, we got new shelves. That's right. Or, or one new shelf. I had another shelf here, and apparently it disappeared. I had a shelf here. I had all everything all stacked up nice. Uh, but apparently we lost that shelf. I have no idea why, but that is okay. Because we have stuff on the menu today, and every stuff can wait. So uh, this is a silver bar, by the way. We have uh, unlocked the royal uh, city, which means that we can have silver. Let me uh, Actually, let me throw this on the, uh, the fire real quick. There we go. We'll, we'll start this up. As soon as we get close enough, there we go. And uh, we have some really nice stuff here today. This is a, a gold uh, guard. That's a gold pommel. And this is an ivory hilt. So we should have a rather fancy schmancy, uh, you know, handle setup. Which is, that's probably the most, th that is most definitely the most expensive handle that I have set up before. So I am hoping things go well. And uh, th that'll be uh, heating up for another second. I wanted to show you guys something else. Uh, I, I made another one uh, off recording, another sword. Uh, this sword is nothing super magical. And it disappeared. Okay. The sword I made disappeared. Well, I was going to show you guys what a blizzard spell effect looks like, but maybe I sold it and I forgot. I don't know. It, it is plausible. Anyway, let's. Uh, I'm going to sit here and wait for this to heat up so we can start forging it, and I will see you guys in a moment. All right, it's hot enough. Let's get to specking it. And uh, here we go. Uh, this forging will take a while. So, uh, you know, I'll get it started here and I will come back when it's uh, almost finished up. So I'll see you guys then. All right, we're back here. And if all goes well, this should be the last heat up, hopefully. If I can actually start hammering it. There we go. You want to move for me? There we go. For some reason, the uh, silver tends to move a lot slower than the iron, which uh, I'm not entirely sure how accurate that would be, but uh, it is what it is. Anyway, let's uh, let's get the fire off for now. Come on, water, do your thing. There we go. And uh, we're going to start working on the, uh, the Damascus for it. Let's throw our box in there, pick this up with the tongs because it's too hot. And uh, hopefully we get this right the first time, but if we don't, I do have a couple of boxes, so we can uh, afford to fudge up a few times, but, you know, hopefully we don't. This is always a, a, a game of chance, pretty much. You can't, I mean, sometimes I think you're just screwed. There's nothing you're doing about it. I mean, I can usually do okay. Uh, what is that one? I guess we can just throw that one there. We, we get another small, we're kind of screwed here. Uh, okay, let's go in there. And this one's going here. Next small has to go on the left. Yep, this one has to go there. And we're going to get nothing but larges from now on. So uh, we just have to pick where they go. Uh, that can go there. And uh, both of these are going to go right in the middle. It doesn't matter, you know, what they are. They kind of just have to go there. Hopefully they're different. And they are! It looks like we got perfect Damascus uh, right off the bat. So I will take that any day of the week. There we go. So uh, let's get to working on our alchemy table here. Uh, let's mix in our iron. There we go. Mix that one in there. Hopefully I actually remembered to restock it. I did. It happens every once in a while. I'll actually remember how to do things. All right. Let's uh, throw some of this in there. We don't have very much, but, you know, we'll get some of it in there. We'll just dump all of it in. We're going to need more than that. We definitely want at least to have the uh, metal covered. So let's exit out of this, put our sword down for a moment. And we're going to go get some more uh, this stuff. I'm actually disappointed. I had the shelf here and I had it all fixed up nice. Uh, it is nice having room for extra, you know, odds and ends. So you don't have to, you know, last second go buy things all the time. We'll put that there. We're also going to need another uh, peroxide. So let's, uh, let's get that one going. There we go. Wow, that looks uh, super fuzzy. You guys seeing that? When I move with it, it like it like warps or something. It's rather strange. All right, let's uh, put this here. 
we don't want to use all this. We just want to move to like here-ish, maybe? You know, something like that. It's hard to get it perfectly right, but we're going to go into like there-ish, I think. If we can manage it. Oh, I went a little bit more than I wanted to, but uh, that's okay. We'll live. All right, let's put this on here, and we'll. Uh, I don't know. We'll. we'll I guess we'll just maybe we'll count it out. I think it's supposed to take like twelve seconds, but I could be wrong. I don't know. I'm just gonna guesstimate at this point because I should have been counting already. Ah, uh, stuff happens. I'm not good at guesstimating where we should be on this. I can never get the color quite right. I'm gonna take it off right there. If it's not right, stuff happens because I can never get it right. It'll never be perfect. Uh, let's pour some of this in. We're definitely, I'm pretty sure we're going to need all of this at the very least. Could be wrong. I'll go a little bit slow. Just in case. Yeah, that's all of it. So we're going to need to uh, get some more. Uh, mix it. No, let's uh, get out of here. Put our sword down for a second so we can pick this up. There we go. All right, let's pick our sword back up. Our blade, I guess it's not technically a sword yet, is it? You know, because uh, we don't have a handle and stuff, and it's not like uh, ground down or anything yet. All right, let's put this in slow. We want to go for a dark reddish brown, which I can never quite get perfect. I think that might be it. I don't know. I want to go like a little tiny bit more, but I'm afraid if I do, we're going to screw it up. I'm just going to a little, little baby tiny bit more. Well, that's it. That's the color I want. I'm not sure if that's perfect, but I've gotten good Damascus with it looking like this. All right, so let's go. Let's uh, put this on the blade here. Let's uh, pour it onto the sword. It should be enough. It looks like enough to me. Yeah, it was just a perfect Damascus. Perfect Damascus? I have never done that. Uh, let's put it down. We got four minutes, so at uh, 4.48, 40, we'll, uh, we'll be ready. So uh, I will be back when that's done, and we'll rinse it off, and we'll have perfect Damascus for the first time ever. Holy moly. So I will see you guys then. Okay, guys, we are back. It is the allotted time, 12.48, 40 or so. So uh, let's rinse off our blade here. There we go. Get all that solution off of it. Put it in there. Make sure, make sure it's all... Off there, God forbid we ruin our perfect Damascus, I would cry. I would cry, and you guys would be witness to a grand man crying. It'd be very sad, very sad. All right, let's put our, uh, our weapon in here, because now we're going to temper it. Let's get it going. I have never gotten perfect Damascus before. I really hope that goes all the way to the end, that we could see it on our on our stand being perfect. I will be, I'll, uh, I'll post this all over the place, like, look at my perfect Damascus, and I'll be so proud. Go away, people. We're not going up there. We're making our awesome sword here, and you guys are being our hindrance. All right, guys, we're going to wait till this, uh, you know, heats up, and I will be right back with the uh, warmed-up sword. All right, guys, we're back. Our sword is nice and cherry for us. Let's uh, temper it. All right, wait till the uh, flames go out. Same old drill. Come on, flames. There we go. Sword is tempered. I guess we should officially cool it off. It's pretty hot here. Nice blue smoke. I don't think it normally does that blue smoke. I think it only does that after you've done the Damascus. And that might be a signal from the developers, like, hey, you're on the right track or something. Or, hey, you screwed up. You know, it could go either way there. Let's save our uh, stuff there. Our coal, so we don't have to buy any more. Can we get a better look at this? I'm going to look at it. Uh, all right, we'll, we'll put it on the grinder. We got, we got to look at it here. We can see a little bit of the pattern. It's a little bit, a little bit hard to see, honestly. All right, let's see. Hopefully, we can get a good grind and make this like the best sword ever. All right, let's go. Let's do it. 96, boo. I think the more points I put into grinding, the worse I get at it. It feels like the, the uh, worst things to invest in, honestly. All right, that wasn't so bad. 98%. I can't complain too much about that. Let's, uh, let's go put on our awesome handle. Which we do not have in the uh, in the handle maker thingy. If I didn't say this is a gold pommel I got from the uh, Royal City, I want to say. And this is a gold uh, guard we got from the Royal City. 
and an ivory handle. You guessed it, we got from the uh, royal city. Oh, we dropped that on the floor. Oh, come on. You know you want to go in there for us. There we go. I don't know why that was fighting us so bad. All right, here we go. Let's make the best hilt we've ever made in our entire lives. Let's work on it. It's two. Is that a good one? Eh, I've actually gotten full 100% before, but of course I'm not going to do it now. Because we can't be that lucky, can we? I'm not going to cry about 95s, though. They're still pretty good. I did better that time. Let's see if we can end it off with 100s. That'd be nice. That's one. Two. Three. Alright, well, 98.33. I am not going to complain about that too much. I want to go look and see what it says upstairs when we put this on the thing. Does it say perfect Damascus? Does it say that? Damascus, excellent. Oh, I thought it'd say perfect. Oh, it says just perfect on the uh, on the achievement. So maybe that is perfect. 347. I We have a silver, silver sword? How can you have a silver, silver sword? I mean, I mean, honestly, just the uh, just the blade is silver. Wow, that's worth. This is worth thirty two hundred fifty four, just by itself. That is insane to me. I'm no way in heck am I going to sell this to you, guy. I'm not done with it yet. Let's see what you want. Hey, I want to buy a decent sword below thirty two hundred. Blah 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 blah. No, get out of here. Nobody likes you. I'm tired of you and your begging me for stuff. Alright. Now, I have a surprise for you guys, which is also a surprise for me, because I've never I've never uh, used this before. This is a uh, fire crystal. I don't know if you can see it. It's like reddish color. Um, hopefully this is the right one. Yeah, that, that's, that's one I actually got out the mine. I have no idea what it is. But I, I picked up the uh, fire spell, and I got a fire crystal here. So we're going to have a flaming sword, which will be my very first flaming sword. Uh, well, flaming bladed sword. I've, I, I have had a flaming uh, pommel sword. Anyway, let's throw this on here if it'll light up for me. There we go. And we have to find the uh, fire brand here because I've never seen it. Fire has to look like this. Interesting. I have not seen this one at all. So one thing we don't need. Uh, we don't need this. So you can go down here. Okay, what else do we not need? I have no idea. Uh, I guess we'll figure it out. You know, we'll get there. So this goes here. Uh, let, me, let me just... Where do I want this? Oh, we don't need this one, actually. That's one we don't need. You get out of here, too. Alright, so this one will have to go all the way over to the bottom. These have to switch, so you'll be over here. You have to do other stuff. If I can go like that and move you out the way, go up there. Uh, where can I move you in the interim? So I want you over here, and you have to be over here. Uh, what can I do with this dot? I can, like, move a million things out the way here to get it here. Yeah, dot, go over here. And, uh, I think I've, like, messed everything up. That's okay. This is how things are supposed to be. We need to get this circle over here. So, let me see here. I can kind of do this. There we go. Put things back. And uh, this is supposed to be over here. There we go. We have a fire sword. This is my very first fire sword. And look at that. Look how fiery it is. I'm so proud of it. It's such an awesome fire sword. I don't know how you handle this without hurting yourself. It looks looks like it'd be rather dangerous. Let's go see how much money we get for our fire spell on there. A fire spell added 700. That is pretty good. I think the uh, crystal for it only costs like 400, so that's like 300 pure profit right there. Alright, we're already like way past my most expensive spell already, and we're not even done yet. Because you know what? We're going to put a fire, uh, you know, enchantment thingy on it here. <laughs> I wonder if putting it in here is going to put the fire out. There we go. We're going to put that there, and uh, where's the, uh, I got myself a red clover. There we go. And we're going to put on a fire thing. It's going to be all fiery, and it's going to be awesome. We'll put that there, and uh, let me see here. Where did my... I think I'm going to use... 
uh, this cup here. I think that's the uh, the best thing I can mix with fire here. So let's do that. All right, it's it's fire. So now it has to fire a, a blade, but now it also has fire coming out the uh, pommel there. So look at this thing. This is crazy. Honestly, you can't really see the bottom part, but we'll get to that. Anyway, this is the. Uh, I don't, I don't, this was the new thing. I haven't showed you guys yet. I mean, I'm just like so excited that I don't even know what I'm doing. I'm just like, oh my god, look at all this cool stuff. All right, what do you want, guy? What do you want? You're like driving me crazy here. Can you assemble my blade? I mean, I guess... I, mean, I kind of been telling you guys to screw off the whole episode, so I should like help you out a little bit. I feel bad for like neglecting these guys too much. And then I'll get mad at them for not coming and buying my sword. So, you know, I, I gotta do the grunt work and make them happy. So let's just get this out the way. Then we'll uh, go worship. <laughs> then I'll go back and worship my sword some more. There we go. 100% average. Doing good so far. All right. One more. Did I 100% this one? Yeah, 100% total average. See, I can do it. It can happen sometimes. It doesn't always happen. I'm like surprised. I'm surprised like the whole place isn't catching up. On fire. This thing's so fiery! The fire is awesome! I'm gonna put it like in the middle, on top, like in the place of glory here. And how much is it worth now? What is the official total here? The official total is 4,554. This is my best sword by like a country mile. By like so much it's ridiculous. I'm gonna screenshot this and show everyone who's ever lived because I am so proud of it. Can I, can I get a better look at it? There we go. We can all share in the screenshots together. Maybe that'll be my uh, my thumbnail. Who knows? But we have a flaming sword of awesomeness. Can I, can I actually I'll get up close here? There we go. This might very well actually be the screenshots. Just look at that thing. It's beautiful. Anyway, guys, uh, I'm going to stop rambling here uh, because I've been rambling for too long now. And the episode is essentially over. So uh, thank you guys so much for watching. This game is called Fantasy Blacksmith. I will have a link down in the description if you want to try it out. You know, if you want to make flaming swords of awesomeness, well, now you can. Uh, well, thank you guys so much for watching. If you're new here, you can subscribe. Click that bell icon so you know when I put out new content. Smash that like button. Leave a comment down below. And thank you guys so much for watching. Seriously, thank you. And I will see you next time. Bye-bye.